Zenbo Jr. developed by Asus. Welcome to Project Ventive. In our today's video, we are going to talk about the Zenbo Jr. developed by Asus. Before the video starts, like and share this video also subscribe to our YouTube channel Project Ventive for more updates. Today at Computex, Asus Chairman Johnny Shi took the stage to introduce something a little bit different, albeit entirely on trend, a house robot. Before presenting Zenbo, the home robot, he stated that our objective is to allow robotic computing for every family. Particularly geared towards senior citizens, its mission statement reads help, entertainment, and companionship. The promise that the robot would communicate with both conventional, and modern electronic gadgets in the home is, however, the most intriguing aspect of this product. You will be able to inspect who is at the door using a connected camera, and then you will be able to use the robot's face to remotely unlock the door. If Zenbo can communicate in your native tongue, it will also be able to link to your home's lighting, televisions, and climate control systems. The robot can navigate its environment on its own and can respond to voice commands. The face of the Zenbo can also be used as a touchpad interface. When it's not blushing, you'll have the ability to make video calls, shop online, and stream video entertainment. It's still early, but Asus promises that Zenbo will eventually be able to provide voiced reminders to its customers, such as reminders to take medications or attend doctor's appointments. You'll even be able to take control of the robot and look at the issue using the built-in camera on Zenbo if someone in your family gets hurt. If someone gets hurt, the robot will be able to send emergency signals to other members of the family. To entertain children, the robot will be able to, clumsily and mechanically, dance according to music and will also be able to read books out loud from the library that is already built into it. Naturally, Asus is advertising a Zenbo developer program, which includes access to the bot's software development kit SDK, as well as additional information to assist in the birth of apps this is very crucial if the robot is to be successful. It will inevitably be compared to SoftBank's Pepper Home Robot, and there are, in fact, a few similarities between the two. However, if there is one important lesson that Asus can learn from its larger Japanese competitor, it is that a device such as this needs a reason to exist to be successful. Zenbo's success may depend on how well it executes these smart home tactics. That will be of great assistance, even though the price of $599 is relatively low for a house robot. The Asus Zenbo is a house robot that can wheel itself around, answer to the phrase, hey Zenbo much in the same way as many ordinary smartphone assistants do, and function as a smartphone hub. There is a lack of specific information regarding its launch, however, the price will start at $599. The current feature set of Zenbo is geared toward children and senior citizens, and has been referred to as a clever little friend by Johnny Shi, chairman of Asus. The robot is currently capable of performing many of the same tasks that you would anticipate from a voice-controlled tablet computer on wheels, albeit with a select number of custom applications. These applications include a library of stories that involve different voices, as well as controlling the room's lighting, as well as reminding seniors of appointments, and notifying family members in the event of a fall. However, the company is looking for partners and developers to get on board. According to Xi, for decades, humans have fantasized of possessing such a companion, one that is wise, near and dear to our hearts, and constantly at our disposal. Our goal is to make it possible for every home to have access to robotic computing. Asus introduced an entirely new lineup of Zen books, transformers, and smartphones for the remainder of its customary pre-Computex news briefing. The Asus ZenBook 3 is a portable computer that comes equipped with a display measuring 12.5 inches, a laptop computer powered by an Intel Core i7 processor, 16GB of DDR3 2133MHz RAM, up to 1TB of solid, state storage, quad speakers, 9 hours of battery life, and a USB-C connector. The firm Asus is marketing its product to those who are interested in purchasing a MacBook, by stating that its product is 107 times quicker than the MacBook Air and 15 times faster than the MacBook. The price of the ZenBook 3 begins at the mark of $2.000 for the top-of-the-line version, that has 16GB of RAM and 1TB of storage, 
but it decreases to the mark of $1.000 for a device that has 4GB of RAM and 256GB of storage. Asus has introduced the Transformer Pro 3 and the Transformer 3 to compete in the market for two-in-one devices. The Transformer Pro 3 comes with a 12.6-inch display that has a resolution of 2880 by 1920 pixels, an Intel Core i7 processor, up to 16GB of DDR3, 2133 MHz RAM, 1TB of SSD storage, and a 13MP camera additionally, it has Thunderbolt 3 a separate USB 3.0 port, and an HDMI port that is the standard size. In addition, the Pro may third be purchased with a dock that has ports for USB-C, USB 3.0, HDMI, VGA, RJ45 LAN, and a 3-in, 1 SD card reading connector, a pen, an audio pod with 4 speakers, and a ROG XG Station 2 that acts as an external graphics card. The Pro May 3rd be purchased for a starting price of $1.000 for a 256GB model that also comes with a stylus and a cover. The Transformer 3 is distinguished from its Pro siblings by the fact that it can have up to 512GB of storage space, up to 8GB of DDR3, 1866MHz RAM, and a starting price of $799 for the 256GB version. Additionally, the Pro siblings have a maximum memory capacity of just 256GB. Asus introduced the Zenfone 3 line of smartphones, which included the Zenfone 3 Ultra, during the same period. The monstrous smartphone has a massive 6.8-inch display, a battery with a capacity of 4600mAh, a camera with a resolution of 23MP, a processor with Qualcomm Snapdragon 652 architecture, Adreno 510 graphics, and as much as 4GB of RAM. The Ultra will be available at a starting price of $479. The Zenfone 3 Deluxe is the company's flagship smartphone, and it features a 5.7-inch Super AMOLED display, a camera with a resolution of 23 megapixels, a processor with a Snapdragon 820, a graphics processing unit with Adreno 530, and up to 6GB of RAM. According to Asus, the phone has a metal unibody design, and there are no indicators to indicate where the antenna is located on the phone. The phone will most likely cost more than $499 and has the capability of receiving a charge of 60% in just 39 minutes when it is powered by USB-C. The standard model of the Zenfone 3 will have a starting price of at least $249, and will be equipped with a Qualcomm Snapdragon 625 processor, an Adreno 506 graphics processing unit, a 16-megapixel camera, and as much as 4GB of RAM. Are you willing to share your home with a robot? As a home security assistant, the Asus Zenbo can monitor the home for potentially dangerous scenarios and send notifications to family members' smartphones. Family members' smartphones can also access the Zenbo to help them navigate the house and keep an eye on things using the device's built-in camera. As a home care assistant, Zenbo reminds its users to take their medications, go to their doctor's appointments, and stick to their exercise routines. In the kitchen, it can provide you with recipes, make video chats, manage the lights and the air conditioning, access social media, shop for you, and stream television shows and movies. Other capabilities include these. Voice instructions were used for all of these actions. However, it is not only intended for those of retirement age. Zenbo is a delightful companion for the whole family as well as an educational playmate for children. It keeps children entertained with interactive stories and learning games that help them develop their imagination as well as their ability to think logically. To offer a new dimension of involvement, Zenbo comes equipped with an inbuilt library of stories, each of which he can retell in one of many distinct voices while simultaneously showing accompanying graphics on his screen and taking control of the lighting in the area. The following are the primary characteristics of the Asus Zenbo. Move, because it has a camera built right into it, it is free to roam wherever inside the house. As you can see, it is also capable of recording videos and taking photographs. Communicate verbally. It can respond to commands or questions, remind you of key appointments, or tell you a story. Here, 
It can hear queries and requests, and it can answer them. Sound, it is capable of playing music through a speaker of great quality. Connect, it can connect to and control smart home gadgets, as well as other online things and interact with services that are connected. Learn, through the use of proactive artificial intelligence, it can learn and adapt to your preferences. Express, it can communicate its feelings through a variety of facial expressions. Smart Helper or Hazardous Toy The Asus Zenbo and Home Robotics in general come with several risks and drawbacks, in addition to the benefits that we have discussed so far. If, for example, the Zenbo is hacked, then every smart home gadget in the home may be controlled, monitored, and manipulated. Malware might infect any of the household appliances, and there is always the risk that confidential information could be compromised and sold. People will worry that they will have a lot of privacy issues with such a device, such as having data leaks, recording of voice commands, etc., but all of that could happen with mobile and smart home devices as well. People will fear that they will have a lot of privacy issues with such a device. The Asus Zenbo, according to some detractors, is nothing more than a combination of the characteristics of the Amazon Echo or Google Home with the appearance of an iMac G4 on wheels, and they believe that the Zenbo will need to continue to improve to prevail against significant challenges. Several studies were carried out, and the results all demonstrated that interacting with a robot can be just as taxing on one's patients as dealing with animals or people. There were occasions when Zenbo did not react as expected or did not proceed in the specified direction. On other occasions, Zenbo was unable to recognize the gestures being made with the camera, or it simply paused and did nothing. However, the model is still in its infancy, and the business plans to continue honing both its behavior and its sensitivity. The Asus Zenbo will enter its final stage with the assistance of the Zenbo developer program, and the backing of a large number of innovative minds. It is possible that in the not-too-distant future, the Zenbo will be the intelligent little buddy we have in our homes. This is end of this video do you feel it nice? Make sure to give your valuable response in our comment section below, and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel Project Ventive for more videos.